The main characteristic of automotive batteries as well as for other batteries, whether it be a battery for a mobile phone or a music center, is capacity. To determine the capacity of a battery, a fully charged battery is stamped by low current. That is, for a battery with capacity of 55 amperes per hour, the current should be about 2.75 amperes at a temperature of 25 degrees during 20 hours. The voltage should not fall below 10.5 volts. That is, a 100 ampere battery with a current of 5 amperes after 20 hours of operation should produce the voltage below 10.5 volts. The following characteristic is the reserve capacity. The reserve capacity is the time in minutes during which a battery can maintain a voltage of 5 point 10 volts at a current of 25 amperes. In fact, the reserve capacity is the time that a car can drive at a minimum electrical load with a generator off. A loading test shows whether a battery can keep the load to start the engine. To check it, a resistance corresponding to the resistance in a circuit when the engine is running is applied to current leads. After 15 seconds of discharge, the battery should keep a voltage below 9.5 volts at a temperature of 21 degrees. And finally, one of the major characteristics is called cranking amperes. To determine it, the battery is kept at a temperature of minus 18 degrees for several hours. Then one measures the current it produces for 30 seconds. It should be noted that the cold cranking amperes are measured by three different methods. The difference lies in the time of discharge or ultimate voltage. Accordingly, the results will differ too. Large companies indicate all three values, while questionable ones can specify only one value. Moreover, without its interpretation and metering guidance techniques, which can be regarded as a fairly rough, but still a test to measure quality of the battery.